In this video, I'm going to be going over some Prime Day hacks and strategies that you need to be using this year. This is 2021. And so I'm going to be going over some Amazon PPC strategies and some other strategies that you can do while coming up on Prime Day. Now, I found this article on Helium 10, and I'm going to go through that article and then put my own twist on things too. So let me switch over and I'll share my screen and we'll go through that article together. Amazon PPC may seem like a complex subject, but it doesn't have to be. Hit the subscribe button and hit the little bell to be notified whenever we come out with great brand building videos and videos on Amazon PPC. All right, so here's the article written by Grace Coplin on the Helium 10 Prime Day Hacks to Set You Apart from Your Competition. This was a really well-written article. Just a reminder, Prime Day is June 21st through 22nd, so you have seven days from the release of this video to get it in. If you're watching this in the future and you have a Prime Day coming up, this video still applies to that. And so watch these hacks, watch these strategies, and use them, implement them today. So this is kind of a summary of this article. Plan for CPC spikes, we'll talk about how to deal with that. Dropship if all else fails, we'll discuss that in detail. Ensure your lightning deals have enough inventory, drive traffic through outside marketing, and plan for the halo effect. So let's jump in to the first strategy, which is plan for CPC spikes. So what happens is as you're coming into Prime Day, CPC is going to rise before Prime Day because people are clicking and they're putting things on their wish list, they're putting things in their cart, they're waiting for the Prime Day sales. So to combat the CPC spike, what I recommend doing is put a big discount that makes it a no-brainer to buy now. And so let me show you an example of that. One of our products right now, we're trying to get some movement before Prime Day and we're trying to get it up in the ranks. And so our main keyword is tea tree face wash. You can see this product right here and you can see we're number two organically. And so what we're trying to do is stay up at that number two organically position and we're trying to stay up there. And so we did a 50% off coupon. I already clicked it. So that's why it's not highlighted in green, but we're making a no brainer for our audience and for people that are buying on Amazon to buy now instead of waiting till prime day. What that's going to do is it's going to spike your conversion rate. It's going to increase your organic rankings and it's actually going to bring your cost per clicks down instead of spiking them and then you're going to go up for prime day and then you're going to have that prime real estate for prime day which goes into another hack that's just a little bit later on so what does grace say about this hack save and allocate spend for later in the day when competition is already budgeted out for the day this will allow you to win without bidding against a chunk of your competition so what she's talking about is pretty much um saving your budget until the end of the day. So maybe turning down your ads in the morning, turning them up in the afternoon. And you know, this is called day parting and there is technology out there that does it. If you're interested in the technology that actually does this, it actually just came out, put a comment down in the, in the comments down below. And I'd be happy to let you know the software that I recommend that does day parting for you. Fulfillment by merchant. So we've talked about this in depth here. So make sure that you have an FBM order, fulfillment by merchant order on all of your FBA products because if you have a lightning deal and you run out of stock, your, your lightning deal will end, but your FBM deal will come in and that spike in, in sales will cause your organic ranking to increase. So then you'll get some fulfillment by merchant orders as well. What I recommend with FBM is increasing the price just a little bit and offering free shipping. So instead of keeping the price the same with $6 shipping, that's going to kill your conversion rate, increase it by $5, offer free shipping. It's going to increase your conversion rate for those FBM orders. Make sure you have FBM because quite honestly, your stock is very limited in Amazon now and it's getting worse and worse and worse. So make sure you always have an FBM listing on your product. Check on your deals. So check your lightning deals the day before and the day of and the hour before to make sure they're still eligible because sometimes what happens is they might be ineligible. You might have too low of inventory for the lightning deal to run and it just, it might not happen. And then also when you're in the middle of your lightning deal, this is what Grace talks about here is manually edit your deal to increase the quantity if you have the capability. So if you're running through that 100 on your lightning deal really quickly, go in there manually and edit it during the lightning deal, add more quantity of that inventory. One of my favorites, outside marketing. And so not just relying on Amazon for your marketing is huge. So you can use Google with an attribution link direct to your, your page. You can use Facebook getting direct to your page. You can make it enticing. So what we'll do is we'll do a Facebook ad for a 50% off our hydrate tea tree face wash. And we'll target 
previous buyers on our own Shopify store for this product or just overall our Shopify store buyers to get 50% off this on Amazon. And so we'll send a bridge page to them or we'll just send them straight to Amazon, either one. Driving external traffic increases that organic rank, which is gonna help you as well. Finally, the halo effect, kind of talked about this earlier, start driving traffic through advertising now. Why does Grace say this? Well, the better the organic position you have before Prime Day, the less you will have to spend on advertising when the day comes. By spending now when CPC is relatively low and everybody else is reeling, you can get aggressive, put a higher coupon on, drive more sales, get higher up in the ranks, and when that happens, you're gonna pay off in Prime Day. So I just wanna briefly show you kind of what this has done for our brand over the last week. Everybody else right now is pulling back on advertising and we're pushing forward with a higher coupon. And so let me show you what that's looked like in the last week. And it's not too late to get started. You still have a week before Prime Day. So let me show you that. So the last week, we are up 17%, almost 20% week over week from the date range previously. And so you can see right here, this line, this is from one year ago actually, so I can't really show you. So let's remember 90,000. Let's go back to the date range previous, 77,000. So 13 divided by 77, we're up 17%. 17% by using this strategy, big discount code, pushing CPC, pushing external traffic, again, making sure you have your FBM listing on there as well. So let me know what you thought about these strategies. Do you have any strategies or hacks for Prime Day that you should be implementing right now or somebody else should be implementing? Put that down in the comments down below. And then if you're interested in that day parting software that I recommended, put that down in the comments below or shoot me a message and I'll respond back with the software that we use. Amazon PPC may seem like a complex subject, but it doesn't have to be, and that is why we created this channel. On top of Amazon PPC, we're gonna share different tactics and strategies that we've used to build a multi-million dollar business, as well as the strategies that we're using to build a $100 million company, which is our goal. We don't know how we're gonna get there yet, but that's our goal, and we wanna take you along for the ride. So make sure you subscribe to our channel and hit the little bell to be notified whenever we come out with great business building in the Amazon PPC strategies.